Hi, this is Chris from Sonoma Partners with another installment in our video series entitled What's New in Microsoft CRM 2011? And today we're going to talk about chart objects. Now, one of the most obvious uses for chart objects in Microsoft CRM 2011 is the building blocks of the dashboard that most users see when they first log in. And they come in many different forms, funnel charts, bar charts, line graphs, pie graphs, um, and they all point to different types of entities, such as revenue, opportunities, customers, contacts. Uh, but you can also use them in other places within the system. For instance, one great use is you can add charts to any list of records that you're viewing. For instance, I'm viewing my list of active Midwest accounts right here. So I have all the customers that are currently operating out of the Midwest. And I can take those same charts that are available in the dashboard and add them to this list by going to the view ribbon, opening up the charts, and adding a chart either to the right or to the top of the list. Now the great thing about Microsoft CRM is for most entities, there's anywhere between five and 10 out of the box chart objects. So as you can see, this one has four different charts for uh, accounts. Now I'm gonna go ahead and walk through creating a new chart for companies. So I wanna see where the, uh, the companies I'm working with are located at. So I'm gonna create a new chart and we'll go ahead and start building it by picking the state. And we're gonna take a state account of each state and we're gonna label it by state. And you can even add some filters like only viewing the top 10 states, we'll, we'll go ahead and limit it to five. Or you could even take a bottom sample, okay? So now, based on the criteria I've put in, it's kind of pieced together a title. I'm gonna go ahead and overwrite the title. And now we can check, everything looks good. We'll go ahead and keep it as a bar graph, but you can see a lot of other choices too. And we'll go ahead and save and close it. And it'll refresh here in one second. And as you can see, it's real easy to build a chart on the fly. And there's a lot more options that you can build into it. Um, if you have a little bit of development background, you even have the ability to export it into an XML file format and modify the XML behind this. So you can change the font, the font size, and do a lot more with the appearance that you can't do with the wizard out of the box. And as you can see, charts are a flexible way to visualize your data, both through the dashboards and elsewhere throughout the application. For more information about Microsoft CRM 2011, I invite you to contact us at Sonoma Partners. Thank you very much.